Found a lot of work and <laughs> gone into it. We have amazing things happening right in our own backyard mm -hmm. here in the LA area. Yeah. Amber. Oh my goodness. So much going on here in Southern California and especially weather wise. Look at this. The winds continue to be part of our story today. You can see how it's kind of shaking around the camera if you're looking at the screen right now. So we're looking at a lot of these really strong winds that will continue to be part of the story for the rest of the morning. And then we're also dealing with some really cool temperatures because of these winds. Remember that we had some light scattered showers. A lot of places that did not see any rain actually saw more wind than rain. What the wind is doing right now behind the system is trying to push out any of the leftover moisture that's lingering in our atmosphere. 52 degrees currently for the downtown LA area. Hot beverage because of the winds and because it is cool this morning and also as we head into the rest of the afternoon, we're looking at temperatures really going up into the upper 60s. So cooler than normal. I would say make your hot beverage a large one today because it's just one of those mornings you just want to hold those, those cups with both hands just to kind of keep warm. Out the door, we're dealing with these temperatures slowly going up into the 60s by the time we have Head into the middle part of the day and then those winds will still be part of our story depending on where you live. This is where we're seeing some of the strongest gusts right now going through that I-5 corridor and then we're also looking at the winds picking up again in the San Fernando Valley and then also near the Burbank area. Santa Cruz Valley is also being hit with some very strong winds and then near the airport we're looking at these double digit wind gusts and then as we head toward the east we're looking at the Inland Empire not dealing with too much of the gusts but over the mountains Big Bear and also Palm Springs that's where we're seeing more of the gusts uh, picking up as well. So wind advisories for the Antelope Valley in Orange County lasting through the evening. We'll probably see the wind advisories for LA and Ventura County really staying put until this morning and then expiring. So what that means is even though the winds are still going to be part of our story, a lot of it will be under the advisory levels, especially for some of our coastal communities because they're seeing some of the strongest wind gusts right now. By the time we head into the evening, we're still dealing with these breezes. And then finally, once we head into Monday, uh, Wednesday morning, that is, we're still dealing with these lingering winds, but all under advisory levels. So we're still going to wake up to some breezes here and there. And then our temperatures will remain slightly below average today and then gradually warming up as we head into tomorrow in some spots. It's the valleys that will start to see those temperatures go up first. And then that gradual warming trend continues for the rest of the week, just in time for Easter Sunday, where we're looking at those temperatures warming up to the 60s, 70s and 80s. Back to you.